Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm going to talk to you today about the recent shooting in Greenville, or Greenwood, Indiana. Excuse me, Greenwood, Indiana. And Greenwood, Indiana, um, there, this shooter named Jonathan Douglas Sapperman, 20 years old, he walks into this mall and he has um, a backpack and the backpack has a gun and set, about 100,000 rounds of ammunition. He goes into this bathroom near the food court. He's in this bathroom for about an hour, a little bit over an hour, and he, um, he assembles a gun, loads it, then he fires on to the two people that he first sees, and that's Pedro and Rosa Panetta. They're a Greenwood, Indiana couple. And then he also shoots Victor Gomez. And then he wounds two more. But this good Samaritan who's 22 year, who was 22 years old, this good Samaritan who's 22 years old, he survived the attack. He shot and killed Jonathan Douglas Sapperman. And had he not done that, Jonathan Douglas Sapperman would have killed a lot more people. Well, he was legally armed, had a permit for the gun, and he shot and killed Jonathan Douglas Sapperman in self-defense, and he should have in that situation, and God bless him for saving all the lives that he did, the Greenwood police commends him, they praised him for what he did, and they should have, um, because jo Jonathan Douglas Sapperman, um, he, the only records he had before this was, um, in juvenile, he got into a few minor fights as a juvenile and spent some, a few nights in juvenile hall, but it was nothing major, um, he had recently been evicted, um, but there was not hardly any indication that he would go on a mass shooting in a Greenwood, Indiana mall. And so prayers for the entire town of Greenwood as they're dealing with this. God bless the Greenwood Police Department, the EMTs, the firefighters, the Greenwood Mayor, the Chief of Police, um, and the whole town of Greenwood. And then prayers for the victims' families and just sad situation. We don't know the motives behind the attack. They're still investigating this all. Um, he could have just been mentally deranged. He, it could have been a race-based killing because it was, a, it was a white person killing uh, three Hispanic people. Um, he, he could have intended to kill everybody in the mall regardless of color or race. We just, there's just a lot we just don't know right now. So, prayers for Greenwood, Indiana. I hope everybody's doing well. Take care. God bless them. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.